Good evening, everybody. Crypto Strang here. This evening, we'll talk about a project I never spoke about before, Matrix AI Network. Now, it's been around a long time. It was actually founded in 2016. Now, as I've never looked into this before. However, when I've been on Reddit, and also Medium as well, people talk about exciting projects for 2023. Now, this has appeared a lot. I've also seen on Twitter. I've seen all throughout social media, independent people speaking very fondly about Matrix AI Network. So basically, I've gone into more depth. Now, at the moment, I don't own any. But I'm going to keep monitoring to see if they can reach what they're actually stating. Now, as I say, it's been around for quite a while, long while now. It's over six years. You can see it's currently ranked 904 with a market cap of just 4.2 million. So it doesn't look great with projects being around that long, does it, obviously? Fascinating part to me is the fact it's got 3.4 million people watching this on Coin Market Cap, which is actually extraordinary for a project which is getting close to being outside the top 1,000. Now, volume in the last 24 hours, 600,000, not too bad. Not fantastic when you look at the circle and supply of 21 percent but i'll go through that in a minute in more depth now when i've gone through it basically what they're doing they've, they're actually just rolling out matrix 3.0 okay now matrix 1.0 was a blockchain that basically a platform for the first ai optimized blockchain platform okay now matrix 2.0 was a blockchain based ai economy based on data computer power etc now matrix 3.0 is coming out so again, that's why people perhaps get excited about. Now we look at the price. The last 24 hours just been over two cents. Now the all-time high was back in May 2018, last of the previous bull run. You know, when I say one dollar seventy-nine, but we've had the all-time low last month where it's just 0.004. So literally, so in space for a month and a half, we've gone from 0.004 to two cents. So we've done well. We took some profits in literally in the last month. So who knows where it's going to be? I say the supply out there is not fantastic. But we have to see how that develops. But as I said at the moment, just keep an eye on it. Now, we look at the tags. This I always find this fascinating on coin market caps. You see exactly what they're involved with. Now, when you hit this here, you can see the category, collectibles, NFTs, metaverse, industry, AI, and big data, the gaming, mineable, the platforms, the BNB chain, self-reported tags, multiple algorithms, VR, AR, distributed computing, identity, masternode, staking, hybrid, and Web3. So you can see it's got the fundamentals there, but I say, always look at the positives and negatives, and being completely honest and transparent, I'm just surprised it's so lowly ranked for so much hype I've seen. You know, so we're going for more in detail. Now, when you go on the website, matrix.io, you can see here, now, the first thing that hits you straight away is the fact that the amount of man state of their, to their token is basically 248 million in state, but it's saying on coin market cap, the actual circle and supply is 217 million. So perhaps there's, you know, we need to sort of collaborate that and confirm that exactly what is the circle and supply plus what is state, because there is a billion max supply. Okay, so again, you look at the price, but as they develop, who knows? Now, when you go scroll through all day, you can do all different solutions. They have MAN, as they call them, a distributed AI service platform. Okay, if, which I'll show you here briefly is all this. Bank card identification, handwritten text, landmark recognition, fruit vegetables, all about the AI blockchain. Okay, now also when you go back, they've got many other bits to it. The Manta, the ultra machine learning platform. Man Art, a platform dedicated to AI related NFT asset generation authentication. So they've got many parts to their system. Also, Mania, AI assisted NFT trading platform. Now, the DApps, you can see they've got the web wallet. Um, this is basically where you can manage your main cards and stake and win. So when you scroll there, you hit that basically and you go it there. You open your wallet, it's totally private keys. Again, it's your own personal thing. We can also stake as well. Now, they were doing some great staking. I know it's on some exchanges recently, but at the moment, don't seem to be on KU Coin. Now, you can buy this. It's not on a huge amount of exchanges. Again, quite surprised when the project has been around since 2016. It's on KU Coin Gate, QOB, and hit BTC. So not a lot. Um, and I'll say on KU coin, that's a wonderful stake, and that seems to have stopped now. I don't know if that's going to open up again, but again, I think it's a project that I mean, personally, it's on my radar and keep my eye on to see how this Matrix 3.0 is introduced and the partnerships and investments, exec, you know, get involved with it. But at the moment, it's all sort of up in the air. But I say I've seen so much positive vibes about this. I thought it was important I'd done a video just to show you what they're planning. So you got all this, you see the daps again. You've also got a wormhole, they call it the BSC Man Bridge, bio wallet, mobile wallet. When you scroll through, you can see there. Matrix 3.0 is coming, transforming brainwaves into code with AI. AVI is short for Avatar Intelligence. While AI focuses on training machines to have similar capacities as human beings, AVI aims to realize the scenario. Okay, now distribution of the neural data on Matrix blockchain. Matrix 3.0 will build a general purpose platform around Avatar Intelligence, complete control, 
digital avatar, Matrix 3.0 features, receiving ports, distributed storage, intelligence modeling, you can see there, it's got many paths to brainwave based AI algorithm services. Now the four phases of Matrix 3.0, again, it talks about the revolutions, connecting to deep brain, better algorithms, etc. But I think, you know, I say this is a massive moment for them, because obviously this is Matrix 3.0, and the fact the project's still so loaded ranked, again, obviously this is an important year coming up, and if we continue with this bear market, it's highly likely, again, who knows how it's going to progress. We're certainly going to have some exciting projects in 2023, which are going to have huge growth. There will be some profit potential. It's about finding those low cap gems, which have the potential for growth. So the fact that you're introducing 3.0, you've got that opportunity there, but obviously that's not financial advice. So it's growth for us. There's a lot of interesting parts about it, very in-depth, where it talks about the AI, the different parts of their ecosystem. But I say you've also got a decent team. Obviously, based seems to be based mainly in China. Um, extraordinary history amongst all of them. You can see there. You scroll through it and see all different people. Um, so it's got a decent team behind it, which is great to see. Obviously, so that's really good. Now, also on their docs.matrix.io, they give out these reports constantly. Now, I've been through it going through. Now, the first report of December 2022, they do it bi-weekly, and you can see the new wallets added 664, which is that'd be good, especially in a bear market, you can see, and it's so lowly ranked, as I say, so I do like the fact that they do these, I think it's actually important, they're open, and transparent, it's really good to see, but as I say, there's so much files, especially on the gitbook.io, their site, they get all the information, now it's very in-depth, now a lot of this is, blows your mind some of this stuff, so the roadmaps have actually gone for the next few years, which again is great to see, a lot of it is really mind-blowing stuff, you know, read some of that on the screen, you're like, what does all that mean, so it really is high-tech, now I say I think it's fascinating the way they're developing. Now, so you can see there processing integration, distributed storage structures. The fact they're going into the storage part of it is really good. Minting authentication of brainwave data and NFT. Now that's really important. The fact that through their sort of Web three etc. and their ecosystem, they can authenticate the brainwave data NFT. Open ports for uploading the brainwave data. It's takes really in depth stuff. Now you scroll through second half of next year, connecting third party semantic recognition module. There's so much in really mind-blowing stuff, as I say. So, also their process and integration, launching the first application. But here we go. You can actually see the roadmap for the first quarter of 2024. So, again, really in-depth. And you scroll through, and I say the fact they're actually going into the whole of 2024 as well is absolutely incredible with their plan. So, it really is high-end stuff, this it truly is. Now, I say, I like they're also on their docs, is they answer every question you could possibly ask. Why does Matrix exist, for example? It goes in depth there about the security issues, whether it's the DAO attack or on Ethereum, or the many security issues plaguing DeFi projects. Tens of thousands of dollars could be at stake. If security should be an issue for crypto assets, then there's no point in investing them, exactly. So impact on environment, they talk about that, how they save that. But also, what is the vision and mission of Matrix? To build a decentralized, auto-function AI economy, highly efficient blockchain platform, decentralized cloud computing platform, Digital asset authentication platform, digital asset trading platform. Okay, now it goes through there what the main features, how is Matrix different, what exactly does Matrix do, what is Matrix consensus mechanism, what problems does the Matrix solve, everything you could ever ask. Where can I buy mankind? We spoke about that at KU Coin and Gate. Now, there is links below. If you want to join KU Coin and Gate, you haven't already, two fantastic exchanges. I do appreciate anyone who signs up using my referral link, but you know, you don't have to, but please make sure you're on the official KU Coin and Gate sites now scrolling through it's great it's just so much information is literally any any questions you have would be on it literally now there's a lot of information now a lot of the different parts of man and the matrix like i showed you before absolutely fascinating the mania the manta the matrix 3.0 i'd say the bi-weekly reports i think are really good and really interesting so as i say as they develop this has got huge potential now also on their medium page now they just announced this literally this week manta minor deployment manta is a distributed auto machine learning platform built on the matrix mainnet it is based on the auto machine learning application auto ml and its deployment system it utilizes auto ml internet search algorithms to locate an accurate and low density depth deep model so it goes through there a lot of information Let's get it again once again as I mentioned earlier, very in depth and get really into it so i'm going that much depth it's gone forever but you can see here the there is the potential here, and I think sometimes we don't understand fully, which I don't with all this computer and all this blockchain information they're dishing out. Sometimes you can't see the full picture because you understand the basics, but this is incredibly in-depth. But also like this, 
this main screen here, the Matrix 3.0 economic model, like giving it an overview of their whole ecosystem. I do like that. Now that speaks well when you think of the Matrix blockchain, the Manta ML platform, the main NFT, and the Mana's AI service platforms. There's a lot, just those there really does stick out to me. So again, talks there about the economic model, pay man for storage of their token. Users will need to pay man for storage fee when uploading their brainwave data. Manta for computing power. A stake in man as well, make it earn. But I say, when we scroll back to the cost, just under two cents, and I say, back in May 2018, we had $1.79. Who knows where this will go? Now, to me, this is a really fascinating project. You've got huge potential here, but if 2023 and the Matrix 3.0 doesn't come out, they don't market it, they don't get the partnerships with investors, who knows where it could, could go the other way. So it really is a sort of a 50-50, this one, let's put it mildly. So I was fascinated by the people's comments throughout social media. It wasn't just a certain few people doing the same thing, trying to pump it, for example, like that. There was a massive amount of people really super bullish about this. So I will certainly keep my eyes on it. A huge potential. It's going to monitor it, really. Keep track of them on their social media. I'll do follow them on their Twitter, etc. Just want to track, see what their big announcements are. So this one, just to keep your eye on, really, at the moment. I say we have to do an update video in three to six months' time to see how they're developing. Look at the price. Who knows? If we reach the bottom of the bear market, personally, I think we might have another low come, but again, that's no guarantee. But who knows? It could be a wonderful opportunity just under two cents, but who knows? But I think it's all about their development in 2023, it truly is, because they've been around a long time. So thanks very much. Anyone who help as usual, just email me, infocryptostand.com, all my social media links below. Just go and review a lot of projects at the moment, and this one, because of the interaction on social media, I also like their YouTube. I didn't mention their YouTube channel. They have some AMAs in there quite regularly as well, which is great to see. So thanks very much. We'll chat again soon. Cheers now. Bye.